I just I just rolled out of bed. And you know what that means, kids? It's time for your favorite show. It's time for Peter Peter and his puppets. Hello, Youth of America. My name is Percy Peterson, and today we have a wonderful, fantabulous show for you all. So I hope you'll enjoy it. Hey, so what are we going to do today, Percy? And this is where you shut up. You see, children, that's what we do with authority. We undermine it, and we take it down. Hey, so what happened to Pete? Yeah, what happened to Pete? Peter is in Kansas right now on a farm trying to learn how to not be a blabbering, stammering, staggering drunk all the time. That's where Pete is. Today, children, we're going to learn a favorite hobby of mine. Oh, I've been doing this hobby ever since I was a little tyke just like you. Ooh, is it finger painting? No. Ooh, or playing pretend? Nope, my favorite hobby is napkin folding. What? That's fun, right guys? No, it doesn't. Let's begin. So, this first fold is called the rose. Why are we doing this? This is stupid. Barney the ghost just said a no-no word, children. Um, my name is Bob. And, uh, what exactly is a no-no word? Bob said the word stu- Bob, Bob said the S word. And, well, we don't take that. Is this what we're doing now? Policeman, can you, uh, take care of this reckless ghost for us, please? Okay. Step right this way. Hey! Hey! What are you doing? Hey! Let go of me! Hey! Where well, looks like it's just you and me, Vern. Um, sure, I guess so. Okay. So, anyway, the first thing we do, after folding the napkin diagonally, is we roll it, just like this. We leave almost about two inches of spare napkin, because this is going to be our um, petals. Why are we doing this again? Because I said so, Vern! Remember, children, if your parents tell you because I said so, that is a valid answer. You don't need to question the logic. I mean, resistance is futile. What is wrong with you? You know, children, I think we need a word from our sponsor. Stay tuned. Answer my question! Hi, I'm Clark Mantis, and if you're like me, you love dinner time. The one time of the day where we can all get together as a family and eat a nice hot meal and get stuffed afterwards. I'm sure we all love that, but if you're like me, you probably hate what comes afterwards. Clearing off the table, washing those dishes, cleaning off the floor because your clumsy nephew couldn't keep his grape juice in his cup! I feel like a slave. I'm sure you do, which is why I have a solution! Just get a new kitchen! Introducing Kitchen 6000! <laughs> because you just don't want to, then just call the number on the screen and within 20 hours, you'll have a brand new kitchen placed in your home. A specialized team of construction men will be responsible for coming into your home, taking out your old kitchen, and placing in a brand new one that your mother-in-law is most likely going to complain about because she doesn't like the color of the tile. Oh, oh, wow. Uh... This is wonderful. All for the low price of everything your parents make in a month. This is a limited once in a lifetime opportunity, so you better call now so you can get your brand new Kitchen 6000. We have two left. Hold on there, little spiky camper. Call in the next three minutes or less, and we'll give you a double order of my sock. Kitchen 6000, a specialized team of men that is going to replace your kitchen is not responsible for anything that gets misplaced while they are in your home. Don't attempt to take the kitchen out by yourself because you'll hurt yourself and we don't want that. Call the next three minutes or less and you can get a special order of Clark socks. This is my show. Okay. He's not coming back. He's not coming back. He's going to be a booze hound his whole life. He's, he's never coming back to this show. It's mine. Oh, hello, children. The next, the next napkin folding thing we're gonna do is called the pocket. Welcome. When did you get back here? So first, we fold the napkin into four. Just How like long that. has he been there? Oh, I've been here this whole time. Then, we take the napkin and we roll it. Where's Pops a ghost? Flap by flap, just like this. That's uh, that's none of your concern, Vern. Yeah. Yeah, flap you're an awful flap, nosy like for this. a stuffed bird. You take that back. Oh yeah. Ah! 
Are you two puppets yeah. to shut up already? Hey, you know what? You know, you know, I really don't want to do this anymore. Oh, wait, wait. I, this... I don't want to. Wait, are we live? Is this, is this live? We're going live right now? Look, I, I don't like working with this guy. I, I hate him more than I hate Pete, and that's saying something. Fine. If you don't like it here, then you can just leave. You know what? I will. I'm, 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 I'm going to leave right now. And I'm taking my puppets with me. He just left. Hello, children. Welcome back. Sorry you had to witness that little mishap there. We lost a couple of our puppet pals. But we have a new puppet pal, and his name is Tommy. Say hello, Tommy. Say hello. Hello, kid. Oh, no, no. Gotta say, hello, children. Hello, Children. See, there you go. There you go. Yes, yes, yes. So, Tommy and I have prepared a song for you, children, and I think you all will enjoy it very much. So, without further ado, uh, are you ready to go, Tom? Oh, oh, yeah, sure, sure. Anything you say. All right, cool. Hit it. A is for apple, fresh from the tree. And B is for bubble bath, one, two, three. C is for car insurance, I'm talking to you. And D is for puppy dog, just for you. What, what is this song? I don't understand what we- take a verse. Uh, E is for elephant, walking along. And F is a friendly face. Hey, I, I thought I was singing this. G one. is for gangrene, and it's kinda sad. Cause H is for homework, and it makes me kinda mad. What the hell is wrong with you? Ha, 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 ha. Hello, children. Um, you gotta stick around because there's more fun stuff coming up now. Because we have another spe special guest. Um, it's got yeah, another special guest coming for you. He's another special guest. Are you gonna tell us who it is? Did I ask you to speak? All right, children, this is the part of the show where fans like you call into the show and we answer. Well, I do anyway. <laughs> so, our first caller is Sammy, and he's from Colorado. Hello? Hi, hi. Hello, hello, hello. Hi, hi, Sammy. Hi, hi, Percy. Hi. Uh, hi. <clears throat> so, how's it going? Hi, hello. Okay, Sammy, we have other callers coming in, so if you want to say something on TV, you can. Mommy, I did TV. Oh my God. Okay, our next caller is Carl, and he's from New York. Hello, Carl, how are you? Man, yo, your show's whack, my guy. Ain't nobody watching this bummy ass. This show, like, all my innocence just thrown out a 12-story window and just break on the ground. <laughs> and now I'm gonna go down and pick up my broken dreams and any ounce of dignity... <laughs> How do people find this channel? Okay, we have a third caller, last caller of the day. He's from Kansas. I didn't catch the name. He's from Kansas, though, so that's kind of cool. We'll find out what his name is now. Hello? Hello, Percy. Hi, who is this? Oh, you know who I am. Do I know? I would think you do, considering the fact that you're sitting on my stool, on my show, talking to my puppets. Hi, Peter. You'll never get away with this, Percy. Oh, but I have, and I am. You see, the ratings have never been better since I've been hosting the show. You're basically yesterday's news now. In fact, I think they're even going to be renaming the show to Percy and his puppets. <laughs> Listen, you little freak. I'm going to get off this farm, and when I do, I'm going to find you and I'm going to tear your tongue out. This is far from... That was uncomfortable. Anyway, children, tune in next time for a brand new episode of the show. And we hope to see you next time, children. I have so much fun with you. Bye!
out? He's out? Peter's out! 